of the chaos. Huh? Of the chaos around here. There's there's too much the chaos. Day, yeah, there is. The day after Christmas, everyone is tired. I'm excited. You're excited? What are you excited for? I feel awesome. Well, I this awesome. this little one here, wherever he's going, is wound up. Maybe. Those guys are not appreciating being stuck outside. Oh gee. And then there's that Sydney, <laughs> who still is not dressed to go outside. Neither are you. You're still in your pajamas. <laughs> <laughs> we still have. So we are headed down to take down the um, Christmas tree stand and um, our plan was originally to get the tractor to do it and that isn't quite running right and it had a whole bunch of ice on the seat because we left it out last week when we were putting new hay in and um, so it was cold and um, I'll let Owen deal with that tonight. So then we went to go use his truck and the battery is dead. So we're going the old fashioned way. We're getting sleds, because I'm not using the minivan. Um, as much as I've used that for everything, I probably shouldn't have. Um, we're, not, we're not doing pine sap in there. Owen's allergic to pine, so um, I don't want him to get sick anytime we go to go anywhere. Um, so we've got, let's see, our dog sled, and we've got Uncle Pat's. Um, hunting or ice fishing sled, whatever, utility sled. I'm not quite uh, sure what it's called. It oh, he only uses it to put up his um, deer stands, according to Beck. And then um, we got Beck's sled that he got for Christmas, and then his broken sled that he had last year for Christmas, because he's pretty rough on stuff. So he, I'm noticing he's getting a new sled every year for Christmas. So we are headed down to start taking down the Christmas trees. We also have to um, put a new hay bale in because we're supposed to get uh, um, snow tonight. We're supposed to get, or over the next few days, we're supposed to get a snowstorm. Um, so I just want to be prepared because we don't quite know how much we're going to get. And um, then, let's see. There was something else we had to do. I hope I wrote it down. Do you hear Sydney coming? Yeah, you're pretty boys, aren't you? Yeah, you're a little chunky. Yeah, you are. Just a little chunky there, aren't you? Why don't you lean it up against the silo? Okay. Do you want to open the silo door for him? No. Why not? It's hard not to hit the fence.
What kind is that, Sid? It's a tree. Some Christmas tree farmer you are. I'm guessing it's a Fraser. That's on. Oh. Good job, Will. Yep, that's why I have to wear gloves. <coughs> Taking a break, warming up, getting some lunch. Yeah. The girls are making coffee. Oop, I can't see what you're doing, bud. Oh, you put it back together? Yeah. You want to show us how you take it apart? So what was your favorite Christmas present you got, Beck? Um, at Grandma and Grandpa, I got this, and then there's my bike. Yeah, you got a new bike. Mm -hmm. And then there's the ball that can fly. That flying ball thing? Ooh, good job. What is your favorite Christmas present that you got at home? My snow pants, and my jacket, mm -hmm. and my sled. And your sled? Beck asked for Carhartts for Christmas, didn't you? Yes, I did. Yep. So he was pretty excited that he got Carhartts. They fit him in the length, but they're a little bulky on you, aren't they? Yeah. My skinny mini. Not as skinny as Sid at all. No. Well, I don't know. That's okay. You can bundle up underneath, can't you? Yeah. Yep. 